This is the second video for the test run on the ATV Trail Locator app. This will actually be the last test run, being that the program is actually ready and it's up on the website, ready to be downloaded. So I'm just going to run you through those steps and then we're going to do a quick test. You go to the main website, you go to projects, you scroll down to etc. Android applications. Pictures do not load when you're on the mobile website. That's why you cannot see anything. You go to ATV Trail Locator Post. You go to the download link. It should automatically start your download. And once it's done, you just tap on that. That actually says install right here. And it's already installed. I changed the interface as you can see. The map is much larger. You have the title over at the top. And the map takes up much of the screen. You have GPS status and GPS accuracy this uh, the text bar right here that says powered by actually starts off with the uh, text of connecting to server so that if the connection is dropped this will change to still trying to connect or connecting to server and once it regains the connection it changes back to powered by and the logo for the website this is also a link so once you tap on that it will bring up the website want to add it to my home page and it's a single top so that if you exit out of it by clicking the home button you can tap it again without you receiving a crash so I'll go over the interface you have the map right here where you can zoom in it automatically pinpoints your location it starts broadcasting I'm on the cell phone network right now, so it is a little slow. Well, that's very slow. I wait for the buffer, but I talk about other things. I've moved the uh, selection options, such as broadcast your location, pinpoint location, and terrain to the menu at the bottom. You select that. You have the option of pinpointing your location. When you select that, it will follow your marker around as you move. Broadcast location simply broadcast your coordinates publicly. And there goes the map just now downloading. So you click broadcast. And the moment you do that, a notification will appear up at the top to tell you that you are publicizing your location. And when you click it again, it will tell you that you're done. And I also added terrain functionality. See how long it takes for this to download. Sometimes the map does go idle when you are changing. So we just tap on it. You can see in the bottom. If you tap on it, it'll um, update itself.
but uh, as of right now, accuracy is 16. We'll actually start driving, and I'll show how it tracks your position. The thing with this is uh, I don't need to test the app it's so much. It's more of testing the server's latency and load capabilities because you can generate around 800 coordinate points, latitude and longitude, so that's about 1,600 points or 1,600 numbers just in a five or eight mile stretch and that's going in a single direction from a single phone so each person traveling five miles in one direction can generate 800 coordinates or 1600 numbers so I'll start driving and I'll show you how it tracks you as you're moving into the sun right now so So the idea is, if you start your application, say you are getting on your dirt bike or your quad and you're ready to go riding, the idea is that you will look around and say, hey, where are some trails that people ride on and where are the people? Imagine that that is someone, you can see that people are over here riding and that also they follow this trail. If you start, if you start off over here, maybe on the highway somewhere crossing over, you can see that people come over here follow this trail to get to where everyone else is at and that simply allows you once again to find where people are riding and find also where people are at when they are riding on the specified trails also the application will only load waypoints that are within the view of your screen so as you can see when you move over waypoints will disappear and then reappear still downloading you can see they appear there in your view 